Hi, it's me again, and I've started a new series called Laser Tricks and Tips. Uh, I'm the same one that does Corel Tips and Tricks, and I do not, I've never really endorsed anybody or a product. Uh, I've had a lot of companies send me software to try out and different things, and um, this is an endorsement. Uh, I met this gentleman a couple of times, and he's from my hometown, Austin, Texas. And him and another guy have started a new company called Enduramark that is as good or better than Ceramark and cheaper and 100% made and packaged in the USA. Um, the quality of the black is just like uh, Ceramark, if not better. I haven't really, I, you know, I bought a can of Ceramark you know, a long time ago, and then the nozzle stopped up, and I wasted the can, and it was expensive. Right now, this company just has it in a paste formula, but it's in a jar that's very easily mixed with denatured alcohol that is readily available anywhere, Home Depot or Lowe's, and you fill it to a line on the jar and shake it up and, and put it in your apparatus. I actually, this is what I used yesterday to, to do it with. I'm not a big fan of these. And the, the, the gentleman that is the chemist said most people are using airbrushes now, which I have one. So in the next weeks or so, I'm going to do airbrushing. And it's going to be a lot cheaper. I've given away thousands of Yeti-type cups over the years because I just wanted, didn't want to do them. I actually am a metal worker, and I coated this with a copper finish and then used the silver. And... Um, it's good effect for me. It probably wouldn't work for you, but they have a they have three products. They have the black, which is normal, which I've never really been a big fan of. And he even said in an email to me yesterday that a lot of the big companies don't are going with the with the silver. And then they have a product called Diamond Dust, which I used on this Yeti, and it looks like it's been etched with a sandblaster. Now, pardon, I only had one Yeti cup and it's been banged up. So it wasn't a brand new cup, but you know, instead of having a sandblasting machine and, and uh, masking it off and the time it takes, uh, it works exactly like the black and the and the silver. I'm I'm going to try the silver. I'm going to get some Yeti type tumblers. But anyway, go to their website and check them out. Uh, they are in the future, in the next three or four months, going to get in an aerosol can. And it's going to be a little less expensive than the competition. And what I like about it, it's 100% made in USA. When you email a question to them, it's, I'm going to call it like a mom and pop shop. shop. Uh, they do their own shipping. Um, you know, he's the chemist that formulated it. He can answer your questions. Uh, one thing he did say that most people put it on too thick. And I mean, I just barely coated this on there. And which is going to save you money in the long run. So go to their website, check them out. Uh, I don't believe there's another product like Diamond Dust out there. And even their black marking is uh, by far, well, I shouldn't say that because I've never bought the, the paste Ceramark. I have bought a paste and where you brush it on and I was not happy with it because it was just too thick. But anyway, so over the next couple of weeks, I'm going to, I'm going to run an airbrush and do a bunch of sampling on some new tumblers and I'll make another video, but, uh, give these guys a shot. I think, uh, you'll, I think you'll be extremely happy anyway. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.